I never thought this day would come. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do. What I do know is, I just got to make them pay. No matter what the cost. They're going to take my weapons away. But I think I got a pretty good plan for that. They won't even see it coming. I'm going to kill that guy one way or another. Oh, what are you doing? Uh, uh, hey, 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 John. Are you cleaning your gun? Uh, I was just making sure I have bullets, bullets in the gun. <laughs> you... Yeah, you... Sure, man. Are you ready for today? Uh, about ready as I can be. Hmm. Yeah. Are you? I feel like I've been ready for this moment ever since it happened. I thought so much about what I'd do after I saw him. What are you going to do, John? You want me to be honest? Pretty honest. I don't know. But they have everything set up. They said their room's built and they got their guards down there. So this is it. I finally get to confront the person who took my last partner away from me. It's not even relieving, you know. It's not like I don't even feel good about it. Because I know they're still dead. Yeah. It... I still feel like it's my fault, but I know it's not. It's... It's just... I know, Davis, I know. It'll be you okay. Know I can't let you do much, right? <laughs> do you honestly feel like if anyone would stop me, they could? They're letting me in there with you for a reason. I think they feel like if you're there, it'll bring my moral self back, but the whole point is for me to go too far. So, I think they want me to go too far. You have to make it convincing, you know? Right. If anything, I know I'm not going to hurt you. So there's a plus, right? Yeah. <laughs> sure. Oof. You ready? Commissioner, why are you sitting on the floor? Commissioner? Probably just tripped. He tripped? Oh, well, well you're going to... He's not owning up to it. Uh, yeah. yeah. I'm ready. No, I just... Uh, left right, my ankle's bothering me now. Yeah. yeah. Darn dog freaking slept on my foot. Uh, it's, okay, right. it's okay. Uh, I'm... You are prepared to go in there. Oh, I got my gun ready and everything. Nope. Give me them. Get the gun, the baton, the handcuffs. Even the bullets? Even the bullets. Okay. Why don't you frisk me afterward? Gun... Handcuffs and the bullets. Is that Baton. everything? <clears throat> no. Yeah, you some... have nothing in your shoes. Oh, no knives in the shoes, sir. Not really the type to go for that. Nah, I'm not superstitious or anything, but I do keep a penny. Think I'm going to choke him out with it? John, I've seen what you've done with the less, so <laughs> you're fine for now. We got guards outside, the room's prepared, everything. Davis, you ready to restrain John if he get gets out of hand? I'll try. I've seen remember, what you do in hand-to-hand -hand combat. You're not a weakling. Remember, we only got one shot at this. 106 is very, very dangerous. Is he John? more self-aware than 107? Is 173? <sighs> Listen... <sighs> I'll, we still have no idea what he is. That's how dangerous he is. For the safety of everybody here, I understand you want to confront your partner's killer, but think of this other killer we're trying to capture. He doesn't just kill the humans. or He just kills anything. I've seen it. Horrible. Things I can't unsee. If you get stuck in there, John... There is a very, very slim chance of you living. I'm 173 was a walk in a ballpark compared to this guy. The only thing that remotely matters to me is just finding out why. Confronting, getting that closure, you know? If anything, he has to come in there to drag me down. So you'll get what you want in the end, right? Mm-hmm. So that's all that matters. 
John, I like you. <laughs> you seem like a great person for the Foundation. You have so much confidence and you're willing to die for us. Not that many people say something like that. Let me tell you something. I think I told it to you last night. I don't work for you. I work for the city. Oh, no. <sighs> now, there is no metal to be allowed in there. So everything's made out of wood or foam. Because those magnets, once they turn on, whatever's in there is going to get ripped to shreds. Or concealed into a tiny black dot. Is our badges going to be okay? They're made out of copper, so they're not going to have that much of an effect. And how is Davis going to plan on restricting me? I'm not exactly weak, John. Yeah, He's well, actually I'm not exactly stupid. Gall, so. <laughs> sure. So. I wouldn't want to fight him. Uh, uh, any, any... So prepared, Justin. Yep. So when I go in there, I what? What's the? What, what do I have to do? How do Just I lower? Interrogate him. How do I lower this guy here? Is there any advice how to do that? Considering yeah. what you've been through, well, I'll let you explain it since you are the senior officer. Researcher. But anyways, I have to get emotional. It attaches to people like that. Oh, Jesus. So I have to be emotional and not kill him, huh? I mean, considering how emotional you were when we told you we had him, this would be a walk in the park for you to get emotional. Davis will go in first in case you get too emotional. Okay. And he is not to touch him unless it's not going anywhere. You got that, Davis? Right. I'm well, mostly here to help John. All right. <sighs> and you're allowed to go whenever you're ready. Davis will go in first. All right, then. Electric magne magnets are off. You're all good. John, are you sure you want to do this? If I don't, it's just going to kill me anyway. We should at least fight, right? Right. Don't walk into a death trap. You try to fight your way out of one. Go on. I'll be right behind you. Good luck, John. Yeah. I feel like Come I need it. Some... Well, well, well. Hello. Hello. So, like this little setup? It's all for you. Hmm. Wait. A little smaller than I wanted to. Yeah, well. Do. Custom jail cells don't come in very often, do they, Davis? No, no, they don't. God, this must cost a fortune. Oh, yeah. Well, we got one of our biggest clients right here. So, do you want to delve into it, or do you just want to keep smiling? I just want to look at you. Go ahead. I see her in you. <laughs> Funny. Not much for clowns. Much less bad jokes. So, when we cut to the chase, I don't like you. You're beneath dirt to me. If it was my like choice, me. you'd get the chair. If it was my choice, I'd choke you out with the table. But I can't. So why don't that we talk what about it? your partner would want? <sighs> my partner's not here. No, is she? John. Here? It's everywhere you are. Of course. I try to keep things close Still to my heart. smell her. All the fear when I... You know, I went through that case file and I never found you. It's weird how you ended up a D-class in the SCP organization. It must have felt nice to have those few days of freedom. Tell me, what'd you do with them? Oh, that's something I'll never know what I did. 
So, you kill my partner, get yourself three more days of freedom, get caught anyway, and now you're here. This must be life for you. Now I'm here. Must feel so good to live life to the fullest. You know, I hear they don't write things on <laughs> killer's tombstones. Because no one really seems to remember them. How do you think people are going to remember you? How do you think people are going to remember your partner? very well there's a statue in the state park but so, you forget you never you forget, forget people that sure maybe at the beginning but eventually be forgotten trust won't me. have a family of her own i've confronted my past my demons her mother i'm the one who had to tell her I'm the one that had to go in there and tell her her daughter died under my watch. Oh, that must have been awful. Terrible, actually. But you're wrong. I don't think I'm wrong. All the people she saved. There's plenty of people who remember good deeds. It only takes one person to change a life. So, you better up I your game. I changed hers forever by killing her. No, you didn't. Her life was exactly what it wanted to be. Helping others. She didn't become a cop to die. She didn't become a cop to live. She became a cop to do what was right. That's why I'm a cop. Dear John, didn't you save her? You can't save everyone. You can't save it everyone are you trying to say it's your fault she's dead it is my fault she's dead you couldn't have stopped me faster faster if i was there i'd have put a bullet in your head John. what there never mind I'd like to introduce you to my new partner yeah, has a little bit of light of skin. A but... new partner already? So you've already forgotten yours. Two years. Two years! I sat there grieving, committing crimes, going under the table, torturing people to find you. Just so I could get the chance to see your ugly face. So I could send you off to hell. But I can see you're already living it, man. You must be so deluded to think and sit there and think what you do is right. <laughs> oh, John, but we're all in hell. Not just me. You as well. Last few weeks, it definitely felt like it. But everything I've dealt with, crazy Legos, SCPs, freaking statue monsters that want to snap my neck. The one thing I am certain about is humanity. And you cannot take that. Away from me. Burn. <laughs> you know, you're kind of funny. It's just because I think you're kind of pathetic. You know. That pathetic that you already forgotten your part? You have a new one. Boy, I would have been happy. <laughs> you know I thought long and hard about what you said new partner new life and what it truly means and honestly I wouldn't have it any other way because I can't change what you did but I'm not going to stop living my life because you took one oh, does that mean you want me to kill your new partner now You'll never get the chance. Oh, I never said I would. If anything, even a move, if you stand out of that chair, the only thing you will feel is the rush of the blood dripping down your neck. John, I can defend myself. Of course. Of course. How about we take things up a notch, huh? 
But we get serious. Oh, I love serious. So do I. I think it's time that we really got into what matters. John's gonna kill that guy. We gotta pull him out. No, this is good. We need him to go to his breaking point if we want to catch SCP-106. I don't think you get it. He is already broken. If I were you, I'd stay quiet. Are you sure? I feel like you would love to know how I killed your partner and left them to bleed out in the rain. You are one sentence away from me cutting your tongue out and letting you bleed out on the floor. John, calm down. You're getting too riled up here. This is what needs to happen, Davis. It's all part of the plan. And besides, I am having way too much fun with my new friend. Took the words right out of my mouth. Now, where was I? Ah, oh, yes. Your dead partner. Wanna know how shocked they looked while I shot them three times? It was such a sight to see. So much emotion. So much pain. It was riveting. It must feel good to know that you were so cowardly you ran away. I can't say I've ever felt that before. I might have ran, but you never stopped running. After that night, you knew it was your fault. So tell me, who's the real coward? I do blame myself, but I stopped running away. I faced my problems and accepted the blame. All I want to know is why. Why did you kill my partner? <laughs> Because it was the only way for me to escape. She would have chased me until I had nowhere else to run. So I did the easiest thing that came to mind. And that was to kill her. You killed my partner for a few more days of freedom. My partner is no longer living because you decided you wanted the easy way out. Yes, it could have been anyone. Even that man beside you. It wouldn't have mattered. If I could, I would do it again. All for that feeling of control. The power to end someone's life as you see fit. It's truly an incredible feeling. You should try it sometime. John, John, I, I, I don't feel... I can promise you the last thing you will feel is your teeth breaking on the floor. You have no idea how long I've waited for this moment. God only knows how many hours I would think of all the ways I would torture you. All the ways I'd make you pay, just so I could send you off to hell. If you had the guts for that, you would have done it when you walked in. How I wish that was true. If I'm being bluntly honest, the only reason you're still breathing is so I can get what I need. And what's that? Closure? God, no! I need SCP-106. You're kidding, right? You're gonna get us all killed. No, just me. But I do plan on taking you on this fun little ride. How on earth do you plan on getting him here? I'm glad you asked. John, what are you- <coughs> You see, they wouldn't let me come in with my gun. However, they let my new partner bring his in. Big mistake on their part. Why in the hell didn't we think of that? He truly is too smart for his own good. Do you think we should pull him out? No, this is all in his hands now. What he does now is on his own volition. You're just bluffing. You wouldn't shoot me. You really mustn't know me that well. Uh, somebody help! He's gonna kill me! This is not part of the plan! I could have sworn it was. Besides, you didn't help my partner. So why would I ever take your forgiveness? <laughs> John, John, don't. If you kill Denny, you would become just like him. You, you told me we were the only protection this city has. Don't throw it away for some lowlife like him. Who would Ashley would have wanted this? No, but she would have liked to be alive. If someone, anyone killed you, I would do nothing but search the earth for them, and do to them what they feel is right to do to others. That's not our jobs, John. We are here to protect those who need us. We're here for the ones who can't protect themselves. I wanted to be your partner to help you, not to see you go deeper into madness. Well, if we're reading the room, I know what I want to happen. That's it. No! Holy crap! Good job. I knew you had it in you. 
Deep down, I know I had it in me to kill him. I wish I did. Hit the switch! You heard him, men. Do it! So this was all just a trap? I saw you kill him, I broke you! Last I checked, rubber bullets don't kill, but they do hurt like hell. He's alive?! Sadly, enjoy containment. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna kill you! John, <laughs> calm down! Done! We gotta count now! <coughs> Guys, out! Davis, come on, Davis, come on, get up! Get up! God, don't come on. Me. shot me! Yeah, I, I shot baby, you! Baby, get up! Get up! <coughs> You're gonna die! <coughs> Just... Come on, hurry. This thing isn't gonna last long unless we close this damn door. Get the door now! <coughs> take him away, Justin. Right yes, now, take on... him away. <coughs> Alright, good. Take Hold him away. Now. Get him out of here. Get out of my sight. <coughs> oh my goodness. Davis, I'm sorry. Don't you talk to me. Don't you dare. <sighs> I trusted you. I, I didn't think it actually... Give him some time. This isn't the first time I've made a mistake with him. He's a good kid. He's gonna be a great detective. Caught 106. All what that matters the now. the hell was that? Going too far, sir. I knew there was rubber bullets in the gun. I knew I wasn't gonna kill him. I seen Davis change them out this morning. I, I knew I, I knew what I was going to do when I walked in. 106 wouldn't have came in there if he didn't think that I was going to go too far. As soon as he thought Brian was dead, that's when he struck. I did what had to be done. And I'm still alive. If anything, I felt like I deserved a credit. Jesus you could have gone overboard and beat him to death with a gun. It's still a fully loaded firearm. Yeah, I shot him one time in the stomach with a rubber round. He's fine. Jesus, you gotta you give him a I point care? for that. 106 wouldn't have came if they just kept doing a shouting match. Yeah, something had to happen eventually. And if it wasn't 106 physical, needs to see pain. I know. If I wouldn't have had the gun, if I didn't take it from Davis, I would have killed him with my hands. All that matters is no one died today. And no one is going to die. Yep, we're gonna get this boy. Up Davis's ribs from that. He's locked in the interrogation room. Give him some time. Davis will be fine. He has thicker skin than you think. Besides, I... he this needed to happen. We had to catch him. If we didn't Try catch him, I would have died. And he'd have killed Davis in that room anyway. He killed all of us. I wouldn't say killed. I would say let you guys rot away for God knows how long. All That's of us. how 106 kills people. All Brings them to his pocket uh, dimensions and they slowly start to decay. Don't you think Are with you? all these guards here, he would have uh, figured out what was happening? Got pissed and killed us all? Sent us to 106 the isn't 106 That's isn't the works. very brightest SCP. Brightest. He just takes and goes. Doesn't really think. Essentially, right. he could have come out through that door, touched both of them, bring them into his dimension, and that would have been it. That's all it takes for him to grab you, and you're gone. But like John said, we got him. Get him ready for transport. I'd rather, I'd rather be sent back to Abel than deal with this crap. Yeah, I'd rather be a cop again. You sure you would want to be with Abel? Guys, guys, I, I really need to talk to Davis. Can you just give me a minute? Take all the time you need. We need to get this thing transported back to the site immediately. Come on. Oh, this isn't going to be good. Better come up with something good. Uh, hey, buddy. I know you're mad. You have every right to be mad. Don't. Don't you talk. I know the gun was filled with rubber bullets. I, I knew you were... Does it gonna... really matter? A little. Jo I... I... <laughs> I was hoping I was wrong in my assessment of you. I, I was hoping I, I, that you wouldn't do it. I didn't. I knew that it was the only way, Davis. 
It's the only way where we're going to get him. And I guess that required you punching me in the chest, huh? John, John, I, I, I feel, I feel like my, I feel like my, my, I feel like, I feel like I broke a ribbon there. I could have fought. Well, there's two ways we can deal with this. You can transfer to a different county, get a new partner, or I can say how I feel. Which one do you want? I'm waiting. Sorry. Davis. If it wasn't you in there, if you weren't in there, I'd have killed him. I'd have stomped his head in. Davis, you are the best partner I've ever had. And I, that's the truth. You are more than capable of taking care of yourself. In that moment, I knew I had to do something. I am sorry that I had to hurt you to get it. There's no other way. If that's not enough, it's fine. I can have the commissioner transfer you somewhere better. Just give me a day. I mean it, Davis. You, you are her amazing partner. Might take more of a day for that rib to heal, though. You know, I really don't like people who hurt my friends. You know I don't care. All I care about is my freedom. I know you do. That is why you'll get it after you do this one last thing. Good. What do I have to do? You see that book? Open it up and read the first thing you see. That all? After dealing with that psycho of a detective, this should be easy. This will be the easiest thing that you ever do. Cardiac arrest? What the hell does- <gasps> What you just read from was SCP-1025. Once you read what is on the page, it happens to you. You tricked me! No. I gave you what you always wanted. Freedom. Enjoy hell. <laughs>